this is going to be a pretty short video. Um, it's going to be a video about this application here. It's called Burn. And I've tried this application for about three months. It's absolutely and completely free. And it's used for burning CDs and DVDs. It's a good alternative to the Finder and to iTunes. As in Finder, you can go through the whole process of making a burn folder or making an impromptu burn folder uh, to burn all your or files and folders. But this interface is very intuitive and easy to use. Okay, so first of all, um, when burning DVDs like the Finder, it has a timer to tell you how long the burn is going to take. From experience, uh, the timer is very accurate, counts down per second, not like some other timers where it keeps jumping around like 15 minutes, 2 minutes, 4 seconds. So there are four options. First is for data. For data, it tells you what the true capacity of the CD and DVD is at the bottom when I inserted a DVD or CD. And it gives you a number of options for the things you want to see. For um, it's right here. For uh, right now, it has all of them checked. For example, um, it calculates the whole file package size of all the files and folders you want to burn. And at the bottom, it even gives a percentage of how full the disk would theoretically be when it's done burning. Um, it also gives options for the file formats the DVD or C uses, whether you want to be Mac or PC or both. Uh, it also allows you to make a digital folder uh, on the C or DVD so you can organize your files. So you just press here. Okay, so it also allows you to burn audio CDs, and it's pretty uh, straightforward here MP3 audio CD. For video, it actually converts um, the media format, so you and when you're done, actually, you can just pop the DVD right into your TV and just start watching. And this is a very uh, easy and intuitive way just to burn video CDs, just to or DVDs rather, to watch on TV. And the last um, feature or last option of all is the copy. And for a copy, you can uh, drop disks and images. So what it means is you can just pop in like a disk image. Um, also, the help files are very helpful. Uh, they come with screenshots and instructions and they explain very clearly what all the options are and what you're supposed to do but it's pretty much simple you just do um, for example drag the things you want and and then you burn very simple and as I said before best of all this app is free so enjoy and thanks for watching